I don't know if anybody else ever gets this issue, but a lot of times I just forget about the Balenciaga trials. Like it's just so, it could be such an easy event that a lot of times I just forget it exists. So I'm gonna finish it up today. Um, I try to use Perpies, but they very rarely work out. So I built this team. Um, it's got the Perpies in the front and then kind of just buffed monster stuff at the end. But I mean, it always ends up, I always end up in some situation where I can't get the Perpies to work. Like there, he had the camouflage and he killed my, uh, oh, what was it? The Paraceridon, so I couldn't knock back. And then he had a Stun Absorber come in next in line. So overall, this hasn't been a great start. But now maybe I can get something going with this, um, with some gene recompositions, get some blood clones. Uh, nope, because then, uh, Sivana has her revenge. I'm gonna skip because one crescendo strike isn't gonna kill. Of course, he's gonna put number four to sleep, who is the next one to get a turn. Not surprising. Thunder Talon's probably gonna put somebody to sleep. No, okay. But I still have four monsters to get through here. I'm not worried about, like, being able to do it. But, you know, the thing that bothers me with using Perpies is it's, like, fat. Or it doesn't bother me. I love the fact that it's fast, as fast as it is. But then when I get all my Perpies killed and it's just, like, the rest of my monsters, then I get super bored because it becomes just this same, like, Oh, I just got to skip with a bunch of monsters, let them kill my death revenge people. And it's just kind of boring, honestly. Like, Ultimate Challenge is fun in small doses. Because I can get bored of just doing that. Okay, let me skip, let me wait until you uh, kill my monsters so that I can... Oh my gosh, see there, I wasn't even paying attention. They killed the burpee. So now literally what's the point? Yeah, that's what's annoying about this team. And I don't have anything to get rid of the Perpies either. Or get rid of the monsters that aren't Perpies. So, you know, um, not the greatest. But here I can do the, the classic uh, cannibalize after Bovenclis does deathmatch mode. So that kind of worked. But I don't think I have enough death revenge potential to actually make this team work because you know i i have to use so many at the so many monsters spots at the start just to have the perpies work out have the perpies work out so yeah this is unfortunate and this is kind of why it's easy to forget about balancing on trials sometimes because they're just not that fun they're just, they just end up being death revenge spam battles, and I get my fair share of those in other places. So, oh, but there I am going to get a clone rune dragon, which is cool. Of course, uh, Flucklosaurus means I can't do anything with my Hansa wolf. Um, they're trying to kill Aura Dragon. I really need Flocklosaurus to die, because Hansa wolf is a big, uh, a big helper in the whole killing people thing, but maybe I can get some cool stuff with Rune Dragon, I don't know, but it looks like I'll end up using another deathmatch mode if I can, not that it'll really matter because of Onigeist with his stealth, okay, there he finally kills the Flocculosaurus, but now he's got two camouflage monsters on the field, and one sitting on hold ground, and he's got, yeah, okay, so that payback killer I severely underestimated. I'm gonna hopefully kill this Vainness now. Oh no, oh no. Please go for Hans the Wolf, okay. I might still be able to do this, maybe. I've got an Insomnia Purify monster. He's got a whole lot of sleep and there goes my Nebulonix. But I can summon him, oh no, summon back an Onigo. That's unfortunate. 
Man, I need I need a trahasis to get a turn. Cause I'm waiting to do that. Oh my gosh. There's so much sleep. Yeah. Onigeist is horrible to run into. I'm gonna go ahead and element accelerate, do a pure cure, then do a double skip. And then we're gonna do the deathmatch, cannibalize. Which is only gonna kill two monsters because uh, no, wait. Oh my gosh, I forgot the um the death sentence from Onigeist. That just killed my um my rune dragon. He was gonna be like my main path to victory. So that's really unfortunate. He's gonna put his own Christine to sleep. Oh, and I wasn't even thinking Survivor's gonna kill him off. Uh, so I need this to hit like Orizar. Or Catmander, I guess. He's gonna kill my Atrahasis. Energy Blast is gonna... Oh, boy. Not do me any good. He's gonna duel, leave, Anka Dragon. I just need him to keep killing Anka Dragon, and then let me keep getting kills. So, like, now, kill Anka Dragon. Oh, no. Well, maybe... Maybe I could still do something here. I can exile. And then if you... Lavaronix, kill Anka Dragon. Oh boy. Wait, I've already used Exile and Oust. Yeah, I trust this. That kills. Yes, sir! See, yeah, so I don't need the Purpies. But when my Purpy dies in the front line, these battles just take so much longer. <laughs> <sighs> oh well. Looks like another camouflage monster. What do I want to do here? I'm going to knock back. Well, I'm going to skip. He's going to do the poison. I'm going to knock back the Voidress. He's just going to shield, which isn't going to do him much. I'm going to clone with the Purpy, because Ultima Dragon is not going to... Uh, what's the word? Stun... Or... Uh, Ultra Nova. <laughs> I'm doing my best. Um, that actually wasn't a good idea, so I'm gonna give turn back to him, let him stun burst again. We're going to gene recomposition, do a clone here, a clone there. Oh, already did a clone there. I'll just skip and do the super beam then. Dude, so many death revenges. Hopefully they don't have anything that can stop s stun here. Ultima Dragon's probably just gonna do, like, Ultra Nova and then kill us all. Yeah, there go my purpies. Oh, now I'm back in this, uh, what do I call it? Oh, no, and he killed the Triasis, too. Oh, that's not good. What can I do here? Well, obviously, I'm going to... I'm going to Eternal Revenge just to stall. We're going to Deathmatch. I'm going to Life Flip. And then I'll do this little fancy thing called Slash All. Ah. <sighs> But, like, now what? Because <laughs> that put my Aura Dragon to hold ground again. I guess I could do an instant switch. Oh, but he just died anyway. Right. Vainness. Yeah, I can't do anything. They're not... I'm just... Oh, jeez. I really want somebody to kill Anka Dragon. But that's really hard to do without also having my Aura Dragon die. Because it's... They either have to target him, or he'll just die. So I'm going to heal regard now, because Vainness... Or not Vainness. Um, Nova, Ma Nova Matrona. I don't know. I don't think I've ever read that name before. I just call her Nova Media. From the Awakened form. But I need her to die. Because she's just going to ruin all the clones that I'm making. Oh, but Vainness has... Yeah, no. I don't win this. There's no way. Because Venus has Payback Killer, and I'm not making any progress with any of these monsters. So, I could just call it off, but also, you never know. There's always a possibility for success, even when it's very, 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 a very slim possibility. It's always possible, you never know. Um, she's going to shield there, I'm going to deathmatch mode course it does nothing against vainness 
but who cares? I killed the Nova Media. Payback Killer still going strong, of course. Oh, stupid. I keep using Survivor on that Taylor Knight. Um, maybe he is fit, Swift Fast Strike. Okay. Oh my gosh. But then there's a Voidress at the end. <sighs> Please kill Voidress. Yo! I can do this. I can win this. Um, if I can manage to kill one of these Doom Engines. Please. Okay, I can do this. I can absolutely do this. He's going to 100 second bomb. I've got my three guardian executes. We'll just take out some of those rockoids. There isn't much. Yeah, there isn't much that these uh, this Midas Dragon and the Bahamazar can do. So we're writing this one up as a win. And like I said, I could have just run away. And I could have, you know, let it, let myself try again and have the perpies work out. But I didn't because, yes, I can normally win these kind of battles, but they just take so long. Like this, I just have to continuously hit the Bahamazar until he dies or until he does an Ultra Quake that's strong enough to kill my Hansa Wolf or Neverlonix, I guess. <sighs> but that's just the price you pay for using Perpies and then having the Perpies not work out completely. <laughs> Just a couple more hits now and he'll be dead. And then I've got two battles left and we'll be done with the balancey on trials. Hopefully this next front line will be conducive to perpy use so that I don't have to worry about stun counter or stun converter. I can handle that. Um, Jackoscorp is stun immune. So I'm going to knock him back. Because I know Transient Bash kills. And now, now we're all set up. Now this is what I'm talking about. Okay, so I can do my shield. We'll just stall a little bit here. Do an accelerate. Do another shield. Do a gene recomposition. Do a headhunter. Another accelerate. Gene recomposition. And now we are golden, except he has a Pandranorka next, and a Arachna Diva, and a Gorga Drake. So, see, it's like, I make some progress, but at what cost? Because now, I mean, it is just going to be those two monsters, really, and a, uh, who's that, XYZ, and the Jack of Scorp that I knocked back. She's going to Vengeance. I guess I can gene recomposition, but the stun's just going to get absorbed, and then Pandranorka's going to have a target. Oh, no, he can't, because Arachnidiva is a protector. Right. So now, this is another thing I don't like with Perpies, is if you run into camouflage stuff, you just have to let them kill you, which is super obnoxious, because, like, they're not smart, and they're not killing the right people, and they do it so slowly... But that's just the price I pay. Oh, and he's already a uh, scapegoated Pandranorka. I'm just going to cannibalize the Perpies, get them out of here. And yeah, this is still going to take quite a long time. Because I can't... Well, no, because now I can Guardian Execute. It's going to kill my Anka Dragon. But I can summon him back. And then that it's over for him. This was nice. This was a, oh, oh, shoot. Well, I mean, it is over. There's nothing he can do. I'm just going to wait until he kills somebody that's going to kill him back. I'll protect there. And there we go. One more battle. Please be perpy. What did I say? Perpy conducive. That would be super nice. Okay. 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 Um, I'm going to knock back Lionheart because he'll probably like do some natural selection shenanigans. And I'm not trying to lose my perpy on the last battle. So we are going to play this one safe and we're going to play it well. I've already got three perpies. 
I've already got them all accelerated. And I should have all of them cloned so far. Yeah, okay. So we are good. And of course he's got another Arachnidiva. Because why not? Let me... Another Arachnidiva. Are you serious? This is crazy. And an Oni... Oh. Oh. <sighs> Onigeist, Arachnidiva, and Tenebris. Are you serious? No way, dude. No way. Oh, oh my gosh. <sighs> that is so annoying. I cannot explain how frustrated that makes me. And he keeps putting people to sleep. Look at this. Oh my gosh. And the Tene... Oh my... This is going to go on forever. What, what am I supposed to do against it? Oh, okay. So I'm honestly not sure how... This isn't going to go on forever, you know? I guess I can Guardian Execute, but what good does that do me? Literally all it does is kill my Aka Dragon, and I don't even have Aura Dragon on the field, so we're going to hold off on that. Um, if I can have Aka Dragon not die now, okay. I'm going to kill Arachna Diva. We're going to summon another Aka Dragon. That's good. And... I don't think I'm going to win this. Because look at that. He's got 15 monsters left. What am I going to do? I guess I'm going <laughs> to... My best is the answer. But yeah, that Tenebris is crazy hard to get rid of. Arachnidiva's doing her thing. I'm going to heal regard because... He's going to Bloodthirst or Dragon. That's going to... Not kill yet. I should have one more life flip. I do. Um, I can't Guardian Execute because Neverlonix is on the field. But I can. You know what? No, I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this. It's going to take too long. And I probably would have lost anyway. Hopefully this one is better. Plumacillisk. And Arachnodrake. What's he going to do? He's just going to stealth, right? Yeah. Um, I'm going to knock back. I'm going to Transient Bash. Ah, oh, jeez. I guess we'll Stun Bomb. And then I have to clone. Okay, cool. So that Stealth Bane didn't kill. I'm going to hold off on doing the Gene Recomposition. We're going to get at least one shield. Now we'll Gene Recomp. We will Accelerate. Go ahead and get another Perpy. And then we'll get right into it. And of course, he puts somebody to sleep. He's got one on one. Oh, that fizzy entrance though. Perfect. Um, what else has he got? No. Not enough. Not enough. Stun everybody. I'll get a clone. We'll keep this going. Keep this going. Can I get a clean victory? Clean victory. Clean victory. Oh, good stuff. See, like, why was that last one? Why did that have to be so hard? When that, I literally finished in, like, 20 seconds. What's up with that? Uh, but we're going to go ahead and take regular Specter Fox. Because he seems to be used a lot more than the, um, whatever that protector was. But there's the Balancing on Trials. Thank you, everybody, so much for watching. And I will see you in the next video.